Hey. 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 Um, you know, I was thinking that maybe we've had some problems because we don't really know each other. So I was thinking why the crew is breaking down the set that we could chat. So what do you think? Okay. Okay. Um, I'll tell you a little bit about myself. Um, I'm from Tacoma, Washington. You're from Tacoma? And oh my god, I have a roommate. Um, her name is Sharon. And she's from Tacoma? No, she's from Rochester. Why? No reason. Um, so after I graduated from journalism school, I got my first job um, as a segment producer on Wild on E. You worked and for I Wild was... on? Yeah. Oh my god! <laughs> you will never guess what my all-time favorite show is. Wild on E. No, Saved by the <laughs> Bell. Mr. Belding, such a hunk. <sighs> really? Um, okay, why don't you tell me about you? Okay, well, um, I now, looking back, realize that I was predestined to work for Foxy News. Really? Yeah, um, I remember when I was seven and my family went on this really big road trip um, mm. to all the states um, with the directions in the names, mm -hmm. like North Dakota, West Virginia, South Carolina. Mm -hmm. And I didn't want to go because I wanted to go on this math camp. And um, they wouldn't let me go. They made me go with them. And I hated it. And? <laughs> and what? Okay. Um, you know, I'm going to tell you a story. Um, it's about how I knew I was predestined to work for Foxy News. So I used to sit in the bathtub when I was a little girl and take my hairbrush and pretend I was interviewing celebrities. So you see, my story has a point. You know, it has a beginning, a middle, and an end, and it has to do with what we're talking about. Do, do you understand or no? Yeah, it was. It's it's like um the first time that I had sex, not out of revenge. Oh, okay, that's that's enough. Um, it was uh, good talking to you, and uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Yeah, it was fun. We should do this more often.